Some people lead by example and motivate others uh, without even trying. My next guest is one of those people. Please welcome Medal of Honor recipient and American hero captain, Florent Groberg. <laughs> captain Groberg, uh, tell us about your time in the Army. Well, I was born in France and uh, moved here in 1994. I was about 11 years old. So I wanted to earn the right to be an American when I was naturalized. I was, I was 18 when I was naturalized. So after college, I went in, I enlisted in the Army, went through officer candidate school, and I just wanted that right and to earn it to be an American. Wow. Tell us how you were injured. On August 8, 2012, I ran a personal security detail for Colonel Mingus. He was in charge of the eastern province of Afghanistan. And we were going to a provincial uh, security meeting in the Kunar province in Asadabad. Our patrol was targeted by two suicide bombers. So as we were walking towards the compound on foot, two motorcycles came towards us. The guys dismounted from their motorcycles, started running away. That's when we thought, this is not good. As I looked to my left, there's a guy walking backwards like this. He does a 180 and he turns into our patrol. At that point, it was a threat, so I left my position for where I was at in, on the field, just went directly at him, hit him my rifle. When I hit my rifle, I realized that he had a vest on, so I grabbed him by the vest, saw Mahoney, my radio man, was sprinted with me, and we just, I just took him, threw him, Mahoney came, finished him down, and he landed at our feet, and he detonated. So you pulled him away from the rest of the troops, and he detonated? detonated. Our job was simple. We ran a security team, so we have to protect the boss. So when you see the threat, she just react with instincts. My reaction was to just get at him and just get him, get him away as far as possible from everybody else. Right. And we did that, and we still lost four individuals. Command Sergeant Major Griffin, Major Gray, Major Kennedy, and Reggie Abdel Fattah while we were killed because of that action. How, what, what injuries did you receive? So I lost 50% of my lower, uh, lower left calf muscle. Uh, so they fused my foot together. I can't feel anything below here. Uh, blown eardrum, lost a lot of hearing in my left ear. I had a mild concussion, Not, nothing too serious with that. But I was lucky. You know, it's, I'm here today. I get to speak, you know, about yeah. this. And, uh... President Obama presented you with the Medal of Honor in November. Uh, what was that like for you? Well, that was probably the most emotional moment I've ever had in my life when the president put the medal around me. When they, ran, they read the whole citation, and I'm standing up like this, and all I could see in front of me were the Gold Star families. Gold Star families are the families of the members that were killed. And they mean the world to me, because my, be my biggest demons that I had when I came back is was I, 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 I was scared that they would be mad at me and they wouldn't accept me because I didn't get to bring back their husband, brothers, wow. son. But they were all there in support. It was emotional. I tried not to cry, and I tried not to lock my knees and fall out on national TV. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and embarrass myself in front of the president. So yeah. it was a, you combine all these together, that was one of the hardest moments of my life. Let me tell you something. These jobs that these young people take on, volunteer to go and serve their country and put their life in harm's way, they are actually cut from a different type of cloth. <laughs> me and you ain't cut from that cloth. They deserve more. We got to find more ways to take better care of them. I, I really do think that, man. I think you're a real hero. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. I tell you, man, out of sight. Thank you, brother. Thank you. And thanks to all my guests today. Stay motivated. Hey, folks, welcome. Uh, thanks for checking out my YouTube channel. Don't forget to click here to subscribe to my channel. That way you won't miss a single hot new video, some really good stuff. And then I want you to click here to see more clips from the show right now.